that what you focus on grows. So the things that you do choose to focus on will actually become more prominent in your life. And they will become more prominent in your mind. What does that translate to? Here's what it translates to. People who focus on problems will always see problems. People who focus on problems will always see problems. So what happens is, okay, you're a problem solver, right? A problem solver naturally focuses on problems. That's the double-edged sword. And so what happens is you'll focus on a problem and it's all you see. But once that problem has been resolved, what happens next? You find a new problem to focus on and it's all you see. So I don't need to tell you what happens in your life. You're always focused on a problem and it's all you see. And this isn't because your life is all problems. It's because that's what you chose to focus on and what you focus on grows and realize that that's a choice you have. That's a mental decision that you're making because Allah has given you both. You can't blame Allah. See, we focus on problems, they become so big, they surround us, and then we blame Allah. But Allah gave you both. Allah gave you, yes, you have a challenge, but you have a lot of blessings at the same time, but you're not focusing on them. You don't even see them, and so they become like nothing to you. And instead you're surrounded, and then you become paralyzed by your problems. And that is why? Because you took that one problem, you hyper-focused on it, and it grew. And it became all you see. And therefore it surrounds you. And then you become paralyzed by it.